Hey everybody, it's Neil, and check out what I have here. I have this Kids Smart Game Watch. So we're gonna check this thing out. And let's see, here is the barcode and stuff on it here. I guess it says, man, I can't even read it. Advancing Kids Watch. So we'll check this thing out. Let's open it up and see what it looks like. If I can open it. Nails are tiny. Okay, so let's see what it looks like here. So oh, let me open it up. Nice little presentation here. Here is the watch. I'll show you that. So that's what it looks like here. Let's see what else is in the box. It's got something under here. Oh, there we go. Okay, and then here's the charger. It looks like it goes USB to USB C, so it is somewhat newer technology for that. And here's the manual, quick start guide for watch. So that's kind of the manual if you need it. Pause it and zoom in. Same on that end there. So let's see what it looks like. So I'll take off the little sticker that was on the front. What did it say? It said, please fully charge before use. And then what did it say? Please make sure the card is FAT32. I guess it's gonna require a SD card to do things on there. So it looks like there's some buttons on the side there. You can probably see those. I guess there's the charging port and the SD card slot. And then, oh, that's funny. I thought I just took off the plastic. It's got two sets of plastic on it. And then on this side here, it's got the power and the light. So let's see how it looks. Let's try to power, let's see what happens, how it says, hello. And it's got a little camera up top. How cool is that? Oh, very cute. Hello. And there it is. So it says it's 9.38 a.m. It's a really cute looking watch, especially for some kid. They were gonna love this thing. And then there's the time, a different way. If we push the buttons, I can see my battery's really low, but let's see if we push the buttons. Oh, there's a camera. So let's see what happens when we wanna take a picture. Let's see, what do we wanna take a picture? Let's take a picture of something down here. I don't know what button's gonna do it. That's it. So there, we took a picture of the thing. Actually, it worked pretty good. Try a picture of me, and I'll show you guys what it looks like. So there's me. See, it actually is a pretty decent quality picture for a watch. That's really cool. I mean, I wish my watch took pictures like that and had a camera this tiny. This is a nice small camera. How cool is that? And let's see, I don't even know what else it can do. Is it a touch screen? It's a touch screen too. So I can do different things on the touch screen. So it's very cool. I mean, I haven't played with it or done anything yet. So oop, I'm just in the camera mode. So if we get out of that, I can touch it. Oh, look at that. As I swipe it, it's got different faces. This is a really cool little watch. For a kid, man, this would be amazing. And oh, you can put frames around the pictures? Okay. This is awesome. Oh, look at that. I can make it like a, a little face. There. Now look at me. Okay, so this is a really cool little watch, so uh, I won't go through too much more of it with, uh, without, without really reading up on it. But you can see it's got a nice rubber band. Uh, it's very flexible and rubbery and feels good. Seems nice and sturdy. Uh, clasps, it's got a double clasp on it. It would probably even fit me. I have fairly small wrists. Yeah, it would totally fit me. Yeah, it fits me even. And I am I have fairly small wrists as a guy, but you can make it real small. You saw how it was. It, it's got holes going all the way up right there. So you can make this thing pretty tiny if you have somebody with a small wrist like that. So very cool. So I'm gonna say this watch is really nice and awesome. Uh, super fairly small and everything like that. It seems like it does everything it needs. So I'm gonna say thumbs up from me. Uh, like this video, links in the description, and I'll be back with some more of you soon.